the thing that Ryan was saying about the transactional is so true. You know, back in the day, you know, I would do things because, oh, I want something out of it. You know, you, you know, I'm doing it. If I do this for you, would you do that for me? And I think this is a really common thing. In fact, me and my beloved, we were like talking the other day. And uh, I'm going to reveal this. She's probably going to kill me if she listens to this. But I don't know if she listens to it anyway. But, um, but she said, oh, I'll get, you know, she said, um, I said, it's still about a cup of tea. I guess a cup of tea. I said, no, I can't do it. It's actually, I said, editing the podcast. I said, I can't do it at the moment. But I do loads of things for you. I do this, I do that, I do the other. And what I said, I actually came back with what this is about. I said, this isn't transactional. I said, this is, we, we do things because we want to do them. Like, I do things, I'll get you a cup of tea. It's not because I want a cup of tea in the future doing it because I want to go and get it for you at this point. And I don't want anything for it. I just want to do it because I love you. And that's how I was doing it. I said, this is what I mean. I, I don't think it's transactional. I think a lot of relationships can go on that way. And we had a good old discussion about it. It's really, really good. And we've been together 20 uh, years and it's really interesting when we have these conversations i i now do things because i want to do them I, I do them and if i don't want to do them i will be polite and say i i won't do that um if people ask you for help um i, I i'm more inclined to to just say yes and really think it's been from a, like a real personal lens when i ask for help which i do ask for help i usually say to someone do you know you know i really like if there's like a lot of things on data for instance or something, i'm not good with data and you guys know i'm not good with technology so if i have to collect a lot of stats and put those stats together i'll try and find someone who's really great at stats because i am no good at, i just know i'm not good at pulling all that stuff together so i'll say to i'll go to someone i'll say to them you know, i really need some help you're really good at this and they are and i'm genuinely they are genuinely really good at it and this is where i need your help and usually the, the response is that they will help me because I recognise their strength and they'll help because they want to help because that's what they love to do. They love to do it. And I'm, I'm, ch I'm tuning into what they love to do. Likewise, when I'm in my place where, where oh, do you know, I need some coaching um, strategy or whatever, people will come to me. And I'm, I'm really happy to do that because that's, that's, speaking to my, that's speaking my language. I can then use my strength in that area. So, But I'm doing it because I want to do it. I'm doing it because... That's, that's, that, that's something I'm really trying to focus on. I'm doing it because I don't want to do it as a transaction. I want to do it because I actually want to do it for the good of what this relationship or, or whatever it is for the good, for the greater good, I suppose, I'm trying to, trying to say. I don't want to do it because I'm expecting something back in the future. That's what I want to get away from. But it's difficult, and I get it, and I understand it. Um, so, yeah, that's my take on it. But it can happen, like you say, anything like relationships, work content you know, work anywhere it, it but it's really really interesting when you actually see and observe it and sometimes you find it in yourself because sometimes you do do it and i'm trying really not to do it that way because i wanted it because i genuinely want to do it because i want to do it and i think from doing that i think from my point of view i actually do a better job because i really want to do it um and that's where that's where i think it, it really the what's in it for me really speaks to me in that way